Sunshine Coast Natural Beauty is complemented by its other natural gifts, theatre, music, literature and visual arts. And you can absorb them all on the Arts and Culture Trail. Show me more. And this work, for instance, the Jim Jim Falls is uh, the start of a series in Queensland. Yeah, it was such beautiful art and it was such a beautiful setting. And there's much, much more. Okay. So I try to make you mine, oh mine. I spend every second. Everyone can be an artist in this gallery. Oh, wow, it is. That really made my heart sing. Let's go listen to some real song. Okay. No, I heard Chris Isaac was awesome here. Sunshine. So this is a really beautiful painting by Charles Blackman, who's one of Australia's most famous painters, and he actually lived here in Budrum. You know, Denise, I wouldn't mind taking up watercolour painting myself. So I try to make you mine, oh mine. I spend every second in the corner of your eyes, just singing la 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 in the sunshine. Hey, Denise, it's time to visit one of these. A bookshop. Now this is exactly how a bookshop should be. Exhaling is like a little bit of encouragement, the smallest dose you need. Well it's not just a book you can hide behind in Mulaney. Here we are in famous Montville, truly an artist's capital and best checked out on foot. Arts and Culture Trail would be complete without a visit to local markets, where there's plenty of collectibles, music and street theatre to see. So hang on to your fedoras because there's more than a dozen to visit on the Sunshine Coast, from your Monday to Mullaney to Noosa. Now let's finish the day on a perfect night. Ah, the perfect end to any Arts and Culture Trail. Live music and a drink. Cheers.